In this video, I wanna talk about how you can improve your work with transitions. Whether you're a video editor or a motion designer, transitions can easily make your work stand out. I mean, there's so much that can go into a project and it's so easy to overlook the cuts between your shots. But by using transitions, they can boost the value of your video and also wow your clients at the same time. However, the built-in transitions in Premiere Pro and even After Effects are just not that great and creating transitions yourself from scratch just takes so many hours. So that's why we produce an amazing transitions pack right here for both After Effects and Premiere Pro. So this pack comes with my favorite 600 seamless transitions that will save you hours and hours of time for years to come. So let me show you how these transitions will boost your value as a content creator and let's jump in. And anytime during this video you wanna take a look at the pack, you can check the link in the description below. All right, so we're gonna start off here in Premiere Pro. We'll jump over to After Effects right after this, see how this works. But here's our extension right here in Premiere Pro. You can preview all transitions uh, within this pack just by hovering over them and seeing what they look like. So as you can see, we have two shots here without a transition. All we have to do is find a transition that we would like to use, click, drag it into the timeline right here for Premiere Pro. And now with this one transition, we're able to just add a little bit more value uh, to our edit and we can quickly add this on to other parts of our edit. So now we can come back here find another transition that we might want to use. Maybe I'll go into the warp category. I love that. I'll just click and drag this into our timeline again. And now really quick, we have our first transition. And now this will move over to our second transition for our next clips. So you can see you can really build out a scene with transitions very quickly. And I'll just go through a couple of other categories here. So we have some RGB uh, roll transitions. We'll come here and bring that in there. And I'm quickly just going to build out the rest of my scene. And now with all of our transitions here in our timeline, we're able to build out an entire you know, sequence of transitions uh, very easily and quickly. And you know, there's a lot of really cool creative transitions uh, in this pack to help your edit stand out uh, and a lot of variety to choose from. All right, so here we are in After Effects. And you know, these transitions can work great with motion graphic as well. Of course, you can bring video in After Effects and buy these transitions. Uh, it all works the same, but I wanted to show some transitions with uh, motion graphics. So. Uh, what we can do is before we can hover over the preview and this time around we don't drag and drop we just click on apply inside of after effects and it'll automatically apply the cut of the transition at the playhead of where you are in the timeline and with the transition applied you know we can reel through our motion graphics and without this transition you know it would just be a standard cut but now we have a unique touch to our cut let's go ahead and take a look at some other transitions if we haven't had enough already uh, this warp transition looks beautiful. We'll go ahead and apply that. So then we had our first transition and now we have our new added transition. You know, just adding a transition on top of motion graphics just makes it seem like you did a lot more work than what you actually did. And for this type of style, it really blends in very well. So there's a lot of opportunities on how to use transitions uh, with your motion graphics. Maybe you're putting together a, you know, a slideshow, a promo video, a lot of options. So I went ahead and added just two more transitions to this overall edit. And I gotta say, it just adds so much more value uh, to our editing process here if we are looking to combine multiple compositions uh, together. Or like I said, this also will work with your footage and other video edits here inside of After Effects. And of course, we didn't go through all the transitions in this pack because you know there's a total of 300 each for After Effects and Premiere Pro making a total of 600 transitions. So you have more transitions than you need on any single project. So that is our quick review of our brand new transitions pack for After Effects and Premiere Pro. So whether you're a video editor or a motion designer, you're gonna be able to pull off some really awesome work really quick. So if you wanna take a look at the pack, that link will be in the description below. But either way, I hope you enjoyed this video and found a little bit of inspiration through the transitions. Uh, but you know, if you're new to our channel, be sure to smash the subscribe button. We post multiple post-production tutorials every single week right here on Sunduck Film. You can hit us up on our Instagram. Uh, we have tutorials on there as well. And always be creative.